Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So at the end of last week, it was quite a busy week for Microsoft because they also rolled out a beta channel build. Build 22635.2850, and that was with the update KB5033453. Now, this uh, beta channel build that rolled out late last week is quite a light build. Um, there's not too much going on, but there are a couple of changes and improvements that are gradually rolling out to the beta channel. If you have this toggle, get the latest updates as soon as they are available turned on. Now, first of all, uh, the first change and improvement is that Windows Share now supports sharing with WhatsApp under the Share Using section, as we can see. And if you don't have WhatsApp installed, you can choose to install it from the Share window directly, which I think is a nice move. And Microsoft says that over time, they plan to try this experience out with other apps as well. So we can expect some other apps to get the same functionality to be able to install those directly from the Share Using window. Now, the Microsoft Store has also received an update to version 22311. And first of all, um, there are three improvements rolling out with this uh, Microsoft Store update. First of all, they are improving the discoverability of instant games. And I posted on this a couple of days ago more in depth, so I'll leave that video down below if you want more info. But just a quick recap, um, because a few months ago, as I posted, the Microsoft Store introduced games that you can play without downloading. So when this feature does roll out to the stable version, yeah, just below gaming in the left-hand menu, you will see a new arcade tab. And if you click on that arcade tab, um, it'll have its own dedicated page that you can browse for instant games. So if you are um, into games and uh, instant games, that may be also a nice move. And then over and above that, they're also, they also have made performance improvements to the Microsoft Store that will make it smoother for you to browse and scroll through various pages. And then one we have featured a bit today in previous videos, if we head back, um, just to mention this for the purpose of this video, they are introducing another way to get um, your products a lot quicker where you can install now as you browse. So you can now install directly while browsing, as we can see. And that means um, you can simply browse through the store's home apps or games pages and hover over a product and click the install button. And there are fewer clicks, Microsoft says, to dive into new apps. And I actually think this is a nice move. And that's it, guys. That's more or less uh, what's rolled out for the beta channel. As mentioned, last week's build was quite a light build. And that was 22635.2850 with the update KB5033453. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.